US, UK, France demand UN investigate Russia's sanctions busting use of Iranian drones in Ukraine. United Nations, AP, the United States, Britain and France demanded Friday that the United Nations urgently investigate Russia's reported use of hundreds of Iranian-provided drones in the war in Ukraine, which would violate UN sanctions. But it's unclear whether the UN will do so in the face of strong opposition from Russia. Russia denies using the Iranian drones, despite widespread evidence that they have been used to attack Ukrainian cities. U.S. Ambassador Linda Thomas-Greenfield noted that the U.S. this month released further information documenting Iran's provision of hundreds of unmanned aerial vehicles, known as UAVs or drones, as well as equipment that can be used in their production. Ukraine and the U.K. also submitted evidence to the United Nations of Iranian drones recovered by the Ukrainian military, she said. This is a matter of life or death for the Ukrainian people the U.S. ambassador told the U.N. Security Council after delivering the statement calling for an investigation, which also was signed by Albania and Ukraine. The five countries accused Russia of violating the Security Council resolution endorsing the 2015 nuclear agreement between Iran and six major powers, not only by procuring hundreds of Mohajer and Shahid drones but also by working with Iran to produce drones inside Russia. The 2015 resolution prohibits all countries from transferring such weapons from Iran without advanced Security Council approval, which was not given, the statement said. Russia has been using these UAVs in recent weeks to strike Kiev, destroy Ukrainian infrastructure, and kill and terrorize Ukrainian civilians, the U.S. and its allies said. The United Nations must respond to growing calls from the international community to investigate these violations. UN Deputy Spokesman Farhan Haq said the UN Secretariat, which is headed by UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres, is still analyzing information it received regarding the alleged transfer of uncrewed aerial vehicles by Iran in a manner inconsistent with the 2015 resolution. He said a report expected soon from Guterres will be discussed this month by experts on the committee monitoring implementation of the resolution and by the 15 member Security Council in July. Russia is one of five permanent members with veto power. Thomas Greenfield told reporters the resolution gives the Secretary General a mandate to open an investigation. Hack gave no indication of whether Guterres would do so. Russia's UN Ambassador Vasily Nebenzia told the Security Council that Ukraine has not given Russia or Iran an iota of credible evidence about the use of Iranian drones. We hope that the Secretary-General has sufficient wisdom not to be misled by our former Western partners, Nebenzia said.